Let's have a run through. We must get this right. First, we have the introductions and the agenda. Second, I talk about the background. Company growth, staffing levels, return on investment, turnover, and pre-tax profit. Third, Derek, you talk about the product range. Now, at this stage of the presentation, we want to give a broad company profile. Don't give too much detail about specific products. Okay, Dom. I'll describe the range and say which products are successful. Good. Mr. Sakai may want to discuss certain products, so be ready for that. At the end of this section of the presentation, I will ask Mr. Sakai if he has any questions. We won't discuss research and development at this stage. That will come at the end. Then, Kate, you talk about major markets and sales strategy. Is everything ready? Everything is ready and rehearsed. Right. The product title goes here. Now, just remind me, is the product called Big Boss or The Big Boss? Big Boss. Okay. These letters? Or these black letters? No, I don't like those letters. Okay. These. Can they be larger? Yes, like this. It looks good like that. Excellent. It's very clear. It's easy to read. That's what I want. Again, welcome to Bybury Systems. We are very honored to have the opportunity of making this presentation to you, Mr. Sakai. In the next hour and a half, we hope to show that, one, Bybury Systems has the right product range for today's marketplace and ambitious plans for the future. Two, that our market share in Europe is growing at a steady rate. Three, that our marketing strategy in the U.S. is very successful. And lastly, four, that we can be a major player in Far Eastern markets. And we're sure that we can be a major player in these markets. If you have any questions, please feel free to interrupt at any time. But first of all, some background information on Bybury Systems. As you know, the company was started over 40 years ago by Mr. Harris Sr. In those early days, the company's core business was model railways and cars. And here we have some copy that tells us what the product can do. Some toys talk, some toys listen, but Big Boss talks and listens to you. And here... And here are the pictures. They show Big Boss with the accessories. What do you think? The pictures are OK, but I don't like the copy. Why not? It's not exciting. It doesn't sell the product. Some toys talk, some toys listen. Big Boss talks and listens to you. It's not the way you say the words, it's the words themselves. They're not right. Some toys talk, some toys listen. No, no, I want new words. Words that give Big Boss status. Words that make him important. Let's move from the general to the specific. I'm going to talk about two of our products. Friendly Fish and Mad Monkey are two products that use the same mechanism. It is a simple mechanism. But this diagram here shows how well the mechanism works with the design of the product. For instance, take a look. I don't like the slogan. No. It's not right. 
every office needs a new boss. It's just not right. Any ideas? Some bosses are big. Some bosses are small. Big boss is the best. No. So this slide here shows a total net income from the previous year. The blue line represents income from those products in the low volume niche market category. The red line represents products in the high volume low margin category. Excuse me, what does the dotted line represent? I'm sorry. This dotted line represents income from accessories and add-ons. Thank you. And why the sharp decrease in February? This is a combination of two things. First, seasonal factors. And second, the end of the product life cycle. OK. So it's not right. We'll get you some alternatives tomorrow or the day after. No. I think I've got it. The one boss your office needs. The one boss your office needs. <laughs> That's good. That's the slogan. Thank you for your very interesting presentation. I would like to tell you one or two things about our operation. As you know, we specialize in electronic games. We have a very large market share in the Far East. We manufacture computerized games for young children. Some games are for adults. This game, for example, is the number one bestseller in Japan. The office workers love it. We know the market responds well to any kind of high-tech executive toy. Big Boss can succeed in the same market. But there is one question I would like to ask. Is it possible to launch Big Boss before January 28th. January 28th? 